all of YouTube land. My name is Wildboy from Six Nine Nine. Welcome back to another video. Now I meant to talk about this uh, the first week of January, but I just haven't had time and everything, so I thought I would talk about it now since I have a little bit of time before. Sorry, I have my microphone a little bit of time before I go to work, but I just wanted to uh, address this because I haven't seen many video or any videos about this other than gameplay, and I thought, hey, I thought this would be the right time to take it out if the creator of this certain game wants me to take this video down. I'll take it out with no problem whatsoever, but. I wanted to talk about the game Monster Girl Island that I played on YouTube a couple of years ago, and that it was my most po it's my most popular gameplay gameplay series on YouTube, and basically the game is about this human who goes to this island, uh, doesn't know how he got there, doesn't know why he's there, and basically it's just full of magical creatures like elves, nikomatas, bunnies, um, robots, uh, two kill tad spiders, and it's really really cool games of gameplay. It's a not safe for work game. Pretty much a porno game, but you can play the first three chapters in, in the interlude on Steam, which is free. And then if you're on the Discord server, you can post, you can play the rest of chapter four, and that's pretty much it. And then and, uh, the recent chapter uh, was in, in the, at the end of 2020, and since then, the creator took down his Patreon and saying, you know, games are going to be, the game will be, once the game's done, it'll be, I'll release the full game. Uh, but... This is gonna to come to a shock to some people who want to know where the game where the game is and everything is, and pretty much uh, Red Man's was posted an announcement updates once a year on his Discord server, which is the first of the year. Like in 2022, he said, "Oh, he's working on the game." In 2023, he's like, "I stayed silent for the right year, but things are gonna get changed for the first uh, changes this year." And he said that at one point he said the game was 70% done, and it's gonna get come released soon. So I was hoping it, my best bet that was going to come at the end of this year if not first or next year uh but he just posted on the discord server which i don't have the picture or anything but i did ha i did um see it and i every and i got left the discord server for this reason and pretty much he posted this on the server at the first of the year that he pretty much abandoned the game and working on little little or solo RPG games, meaning that pretty much he abandoned Monster Girl Island. So, as the way things are looking, or pretty much what it is now, he confirmed uh, the game's gone. The game is abandoned. The game is not going to be any more updates, going to be nothing. So, meaning whatever he put worked into that, uh, we're not going to be able to see. So, no telling how far he got before he just said the hell with it and all that. So, pretty much, a lot of people were not happy about that. And a lot of people left the Discord server. And I left the Discord server because I thought it was a bunch of beat, uh, lot, a bunch of crap. But, that's just my personal opinion. He said he's working on solo, a couple of small solo RG, RPG games that's going to be related to Monster Girl Island. Which, I don't understand what you know. But... Which is a shame because, you know, I fell in love. I love this game a lot. And it was a, um, my most popular gameplay, se a gameplay series on YouTube. It's got over thousands and thousands of views. And I put a lot of time and effort into making those videos. I've had help from friends who helped censor it. I've done some censoring and all that. It's just absolutely a shame that almost a nine-year solo project uh, just, just said fuck it and all that, which is absolutely a shame. I don't know if it was personal problems because I've seen people say, you know, he's just lazy and just playing his Switch games all the time and just playing video games and stuff like that. Like I said, I don't know the guy. The guy said he lives in a third world country, so no telling where, what country he's in and stuff like that. Um, and this guy, a lot of people were calling him scammers and all that because at one point he had about, when he was on Patreon, he had about 11,000 patreons meaning he was probably making over a hundred grand a month which is absolutely crazy one probably one of the most people supported one of the most popular people on patreon because he made this game he made a demo game at the early at the end of 2015 and then chapter one two and three solely on different spread on different web icons and then he released the steam version uh the, the first three chapters in the interlude for patreons and then he released the uh uh the prologue on Steam in about five, it'll be five years this year, and you know I played the first and I played the uh, rest of Chapter Four, so no telling how far he got, no telling how much he got into how far he got to the game because he said it was seventy percent done, so I'm assuming he was on like Chapter Seven, Six or Seven, right? Because he said there's supposed to be nine chapters plus an interlude and an epilogue, so no telling, no telling how the game's gonna end. It sucks that it ended on the cliffhanger with the uh, pop singer, I uh, the pop singer H on. Uh, becoming a villain, so no telling what 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 the plan is now. So pretty much, I think come the tum terms that the game is pretty much gone, pretty much done with. It's pretty much abandoned, scrapped, and stuff, which is absolutely a damn shame. 
because I love this game. People are like, oh, this game will never, ever be released. And it sucks, and I think it's a bunch of BS, but I don't know. I'm not a game play. I'm not a gamer. Barely a gamer. I don't know how to make games. I don't know how Unity works and stuff like that, so I don't know. I don't know how to make games. You know, if I did, I would try to hire a team and all that. I would not do anything like solo, especially this game that takes so long to do. But that's just my personal opinion. I just wanted to give an update on, you know, hey, somebody's like, hey, where's Chapter 5? Or where's the rest of the game? And I'm like, um, and I had to explain in my video about two years, a year and a half ago. So pretty much, that's pretty much what happened to, that's pretty much my, pretty much going to be my final update on Monster Girl Island. I think it's an absolute shame that he just, it was almost, it was 70% done and he just said, fuck it. So, but like I said, I don't know why, what cause of it, you know, I don't know why it probably took too long, just didn't have motivation, stuff like that. So I, I don't know. So that's just my personal opinion. Uh, if you do want to go play the, if you want to go watch the gameplay series, I will put the link in the description down below. If you want to play the game, the first three chapters, I would put the link in the description down below to the Steam page. Um, Otherwise, if you want to play Chapter Four, you gotta go on Discord yourself because I'm not putting the link down there. I I've off the I I left the Discord server, so otherwise you're just gonna have to find that yourself. But anyway, that's pretty much the update on this one. It's an absolute shame, but what do you gotta do? I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. If you did, rate with a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, check out my social media down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching. I'll see you all in a future video. Take it easy.